In this reaction, we have the decomposition of calcium hydroxide, CaOH2. So we're heating up the calcium hydroxide and it decomposes into calcium oxide and water. So to balance it, let's count the atoms up on each side. We have one calcium, we have one oxygen times the two. So we have two oxygens. This two, it applies to everything in parentheses. We have one hydrogen times the two. We have two of those. On the product side, we have one calcium, we have one oxygen. And don't forget this oxygen over here. So we have two oxygen atoms. And then hydrogens, we have two hydrogen atoms right here. And it looks like this equation is already balanced. Everything is the same on both sides. So we're done. This equation's balanced. The thing that people have problems with, two areas really. Realize that this two applies to everything in the parentheses. And on this side, make sure you count both of the oxygen atoms. But that's it. This is the balanced equation for calcium hydroxide decomposing. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.